I've done a few dishes now that require or are served on white rice. And since I haven't done a video on showing how to make white rice or how I make it, I figured now would be a perfect time since I'm going to be making sweet and sour chicken tonight. So, in a medium saucepan here, I'm going to put in three cups of water. And I'm going to turn the heat on high. I'm going to add just a little bit of salt, not much, maybe a quarter teaspoon or so. And I'm going to bring this up to a boil. Now that my water is up to a boil, I'm going to add in two cups of white rice, long grain rice. I have not rinsed it. It is straight out of the package. All I did was go through and pick out the chaff and any beans or whatever that may be in there. But there's no need to rinse that. And it almost immediately comes back to a boil. I'm going to turn the heat down to warm. The lowest setting I can go on my stove top. I'm going to cover it with a tight fitting lid. If you have one of these steamer vents, close it. And I'm going to set the timer for 20 minutes. And after 20 minutes, I will be back. All right, it's been 20 minutes now. My rice has been going. I'm going to shut the heat off. Take a peek under there. Actually, probably shouldn't take the lid off, but I always do just to let some of that steam out. I'm going to take this off the heat and let it set for five minutes before I fluff it up. All right, my rice has been sitting for five minutes now. And then you just want to fluff it up with a fork. And you can see how fluffy that is. It's not sticky at all. Um, it really is not hard to make white rice on the stovetop. A lot of people are intimidated by it. Uh, and if you follow the instructions on the package of the rice, you will get gummy and sticky rice. So this is how I do it. Three cups water, two cups of rice, cook it covered for 20 minutes, and then let it set for five. And there you go. Nicely steamed white rice. Thanks for watching.